Welcome to a special edition of Zoo. It's back and it's demons with the addition of free admission, Minari Mosher, Fire Breather, Ring Matron, and this little guy. There is strong incentive to build a demon zoo deck because I mean, what else are you gonna build with this stuff, right? It's the Madman at the Dark Moon Fair. So this is a zoo deck, I should probably mulligan appropriately, but free admission might be such a good card that I should still keep it. Oh, perfect. Draw two. For negative one mana. Maybe I'll get to play my uh, six mana demon on four. Enter mother. Oh, it's happening. Oh. This is like the perfect first draw setup for this deck. Okay, nice ramping there, Druid. You're so cool. Deal two damage to all minions. Hmm, nah, I should save that. Ooh, raise dead will hit Ring Matron. That's pretty good. Matt Mercer making his entrance. Really good for him. Insane. That's, my That's Matt Mercer. So the order will look silly, but it had to be done in that order. Could have buffed the 3 2 instead. Okay, yes, I missed 6 health. You're right. Saved the Fire Breather for the other exotic mount seller. Oh man. Good old Lunar, Solar, Pump Pop Innervate. What the? Five, eight, eleven, fourteen, fifteen damage. Eighteen. There's only one Void Drinker in this deck uh, for the two Soul Jailers, so it's pretty minor. Just happened to not draw Soul Jailer, I think. The Void Drinker looks out of place, and it was like the last card I put into the deck, but... Uh, I mean, you're building a Demon deck, and there's actually not... You know, it. it's kind of hard to fit in the last cards into the deck. 
This is really good if you manage to play it on carry. And that's not that absurd, I think. See, even if I get what double savage roar, how much damage is it? Okay, this is just plus 10 a piece, so it's 30. I'll kill one of them. Then that's uh, savage savage, 2468, uh, plus 8 plus 8, 24. Savage savage here, ah, let's just, let's just clear. play 5 plus 1 here, so that means trading away two things, I think. I actually don't need to play this. That thing is so big. Is that- it would actually be a mistake to play this right now. Oops. And play this little guy. Mistake to play huge taunt against Supreme Abyssal. Come up with a lethal. Destroy a minion. Your hero takes damage equal to health. Ugh. Okay, I can't actually do that. Not on that thing. So many possibilities. I feel like I have to clear again because you know I'm under danger of Savage Roar. I'm in danger. Savage. I was only accounting for two savage roars, but now there's three! <laughs> there's not very many good reach options in this deck. Also, maybe I got unlucky not drawing my, uh, whatchamacallit, Hand of Gold done. It's Reno Maldito. I remember him. He revealed some sort of card. Hmm, which one was it? I vaguely remember it as a major shaman, I think. I don't think Soulfire is that good in this deck. I mean, that's why it's not in. But maybe. Coin tap. Maybe I'll hand lock it up for a moment. Yeah, coin tap. And then next turn I tap study study.
Huge hand buff coming. Oh, this guy's going for super mega fast Cthune. Yeah, Ring Matron is a little too... Yeah, I should put a bunch of stuff on the board. Probably should play a fire breather. Yeah. <laughs> no, Valfiend actually. Yeah, I can fire breather to clean up. through it all, sure. I'd like to protect my 3-1. Oh, I can with Ring Matron. I wonder if he runs Sap in that deck. Sap would seem a little bit strange, I think. Not a tempo deck. Destroy, yep. Yeah. See, what was the last one? It was the missiles. Which he totally could not have in his deck. In his hand. Whoa! Disgusting. Come, friend. Lol tempo. Did I play this since this for tempo? Yes. Ooh, that for tempo. This lets me tap. We want tap, right? We want tap. And heal. Ooh, Monari Mosher. It's here! But the chances of him drawing it are only 1 in 19. Oh. Okay. Yeah, lifesteal. Very sad. Cthulhu in hand, womp womp. Probably didn't draw Cthulhu either. Let's see, Warrior. I do have one drop, two drop, three drop, but they're kind of lame against the control deck. I guess I'll keep it? It's probably not aggressive enough against a control warrior though. There is one non-demon in the deck, and it would suck to hit it with free admission. But there are so many minions in the deck that I think the chances of hitting uh, Kanrathad is probably slim enough. Also, Kanrathad, when he dies, becomes a demon, 
and I do mulligan for Canrithad. Uh, I figured it was worth having one non-demon in the deck. May or may not be right. Hmm. Could be a very fast start. Looks like it's going to be Tempo Menagerie here. Pretty scary to get plus 9 plus 9 worth of buff on a 2-mana card this fast. But one who knows- oh! Feet of Strength! Oh no! He's about to play a mega card there. There is so much untapped power in this world. This is a 7, 8, 7, 11, 12, 13. <laughs> Ugh. Bumper car. What a madman. Wow, such value. Is he gonna have E, T, C in his deck? Uh, 5 plus 8, 11, 12, 13. Alright, I have enough. That deck probably isn't usually that good, I think. I mean, it probably doesn't usually have such a good start. Not that it's not usually that good. Maybe it is also not usually that good. Blah, 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 blah. Ooh. Gotta keep those in hand for the imp. I want to play Scrap Imp this turn, so I guess I'll play Scrap Imp this turn. I don't want to play Void Walker because I need stuff to buff. Hmm, that's pretty useful. Gets to deal two to my imps. Hmm, that's a lot of damage though. He's thinking, do I take two to the face? Or six to the face? It's too much. Hmm. Not great for me, but not great for him. The imp definitely wants me to wait, but 
Uh, the board state wants me to go. Ugh. Nothing stuck from washer. I've got the Matron Minari Mosher next turn to do 8 damage to something. I 8 to something. Mm. Why do you fall? Definitely the Matron wants to be uh, drawn with the hand. Unlucky, blah blah blah. Dog drew perfectly! <laughs> <laughs> Good match, though. Interesting deck. Ring Matron. If I play Ring Matron, that taunts for four. This is one, two, three. And then probably one there. Five, eight, ten. It's probably not enough. So good luck! Imagine losing the bumper cars. Sadness. Okay, I think I want Hand of Gold on my hand. This time I'll get revenge. Yeah, even though I have a losing record of the deck so far, the Druid high rolled Octasari, and Dog high rolled getting his weapon on turn one, I think he coined it? Into, you know, something really big. There is so much untapped power in this world. This deck is actually impressing that it's, uh, you know, coming close to spite those. This time around looks like dog is, you know, this is a standard opening, cash to find the baton, but maybe that, that's definitely a little slower than last time. Maybe I actually draw my discard the highest card and then get to discard draw three. Can with that protected under the taunt here. What is the question here? Do I want to play Demonic Studies now or hold it? I think I'll hold it, because I don't know what I want in the box yet, I guess.
Interestingly, this means he has another dragon in his hand. Otherwise, he would have, you know, ordered. Unless mistake, the dog doesn't. Oh, mate. Okay. Wait, they're both matrons. They're basically looking at really unlucky here. Hopefully, we don't get really unlucky. Wait, if I demonic studies first, I can't get unlucky. That's worth. Rift Cleaver is going to be really good, since he probably will have a big guy that he's going to play. Ooh, two big guys. I'll put him to one. That's really good. Yep. Out of the way! Wait, did that not work? Demonic studies... I actually... Discard your highest cost card. Maybe that doesn't work. <laughs> Maybe that was a meme. Got lucky. It doesn't work, okay. Hanging in there! Alright, I'm gonna have a bunch of stuff hanging out at one health, I think. There were two different ways to do this. I'm choosing the way that leaves me with a bunch of one health guys. And I hope he doesn't wreck me with bumper cars. These one health minions are so good if he doesn't have the specific answer. And there's a few answers he could have, but if he doesn't have, like, the answer... Such a pain. Nice, he doesn't have it. Should have killed this guy first. Low order. Could have gotten a small chance of uh, rushing that down. Good job, dog. You're hanging, hung in there. 